there's nobody. I'm trying okay I'm trying I'm in NOLA right now I'm in a very very high hotel room as you can see I'm literally on the 41st floor I can see everything and anything and I can't wait for it to be nighttime so the lights can come on the people can come out all the the you know the voodoo and the hoodoo and <laughs> all the stereotypical things that go down in New Orleans go starts right so I'm gonna head to the gym. I'm gonna do my little workout. I was shattered yesterday. I went to Austin work trip, of course, and I came back yesterday morning, and it was such an early flight, and I wasn't talking to you guys. I did it on TikTok, but I did a whole like walk 28,000 steps with me in Austin over on TikTok. I am so drained, like you don't even understand. So I slept the whole day yesterday and I did not work out. So I'm going to hit the gym now. I'm going to eat some food. And guess what? Did you drop a comment? Did you guess? Think about it. Whatever came to mind, drop that comment. So I signed up for a ghost slash vampire slash voodoo history tour of New Orleans and it's a two hour I believe it's a walking tour and I'm really really excited my crew members also signed up for it so it'll be all four of us exploring New Orleans and learning about the history in a story telling format and I'm I'm really really excited because you guys know how I love to walk and I love history I love I love experiencing a city i hope it's by a local person from new orleans that would be really really nice and at least my money would be going towards you know somebody from here so i'm really really excited i'm excited for the food as well not to mention that i also spent tomorrow night in new orleans it's a shorter layover than today but nonetheless it's downtown we'll be able to enjoy the food i'm gonna eat all the food i cooked i know that for sure but i also want to get some beignets and get some maybe oysters maybe i've been seeing some stuff about oysters online it's kind of been deterring me but i may try some oysters again and what else did i want to try uh some seafood and this sandwich is a shrimp well, it's just like their sub sandwich called a po' boys. So I'm really excited to try like those those three things. So yeah, let me go work out and I'll come back to you when I'm meeting my crew downstairs. Bye. I didn't get to show you guys an OOTD, but I will. It is raining and this camera is not waterproof. 
So as soon as I get to a good location where I can talk, I will <laughs> let you know. But yeah, welcome to New Orleans. Welcome to NOLA. 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 Is it still raining? Um, we're right outside of our meetup point, which is called Witch's Brew Gallery. So it's supposed to be a two hour walking tour. Not sure how that's gonna go. It seems like the sun is coming out and that it's clearing up. Maybe the rain is moving that away. Because it seems like it looks, looks clear, right? I think this weather is really good for my skin. It's giving me glur. Um, yeah, and this is the band that they gave us, which is Brew Tours. It's an adult only two hour tour in New Island. So let's go. We're heading on our way now. We're starting off the tour. Do you think that's something? They're still doing that today. We are in the French Quarter. The Times Square French Quarter. They even got a hot dog man right there. Love that. <laughs> building is haunted by a man who used to own it. He lost it in a gamble and murdered himself on the second floor of the haunted the building when they opened up the hotel. He said he the hotel until they um, set up a section for him to kind of like not worship him but honor him. So if y'all want to go pay $50 extra and have dinner with a duffy, please be my guest. Stopping off here at a bar to get some drinks. That's one of my crew members. It's cash only, and I don't have any cash, so I don't know what tea. I may ask one of them to get me something, and I'll just sell them or um, Apple, Apple Cash them the money. But Guys, one of the person in our group bought us this drink. Tell me that's not. I don't know. Fire that broke out in the back here, in the kitchen. A 60 year old enslaved woman was chained to the oven. This is where she gets hairy now. And they were like, who did this to you? She said, I did it to myself because they're gonna put me up in the attic. And if I go to the attic, you don't come out of the attic. This hat. That was like, they had like a, a steak in there, like just cook his brains up. Wait to see if he, he would have part. He invited everybody to the party. It didn't matter if you're a string musician. Any questions about it? Bourbon Street right now. I don't know if you heard me, but there's a lot of music playing, so I don't want to get demonetized. But I got this voodoo. What is this drink called again? Bourbon Street. No, the drink. Oh, it's called Vo voodoo. voodoo. Purple drink. Yeah, purple daiquiri. voodoo. Voodoo daiquiri. Thank yeah, you. Purple drink. <laughs> That's what it's called, and we're really enjoying it. Now we're walking down Bourbon Street, having a good old time. So I'm happy. I don't think this is gonna be a very long vlog. I'm trying to enjoy my time with my crew members, but it, it really is a nice day, and I can't complain. I'm, I'm, I'm glad. I need to come back now during Mardi Gras. We'll see. This 
is Bourbon Street. This is the Bourbon Street that I was hearing about.
gonna break. It kept doing this. suitcase over here and then head downstairs oh, I feel like I'm so early but I keep saying it is always when you feel like you're early you start running late because 
you start lounge or do things you're not supposed to do because you think you have time but you really don't so i'm just gonna really pack up everything and head on downstairs to meet the crew at 5 20 our pickup is 5 25 a.m i'll be back in new orleans at a different hotel and i think today i'm just gonna walk around and get my steps in and just enjoy the sights no nightlife for us because our pickup tomorrow is going to be like 3 something a.m which is too early but we do get home early it's just a very early wake up so i'll see you guys later bye afternoon it is day two in new orleans i tied up my hair and i made the bun really cute i don't know let me know what you think and I'm wearing the same bando top but in black, a skirt from Austin, and my black um, Tory Burch slippers. Yeah, I'm just repeating the same office these days, just different colors. It's so easy to pack and it makes my suitcase a little bit lighter. So I'm going to go meet up with my crew members at this restaurant called Dini's. It's about a 17 minute walk away, so I'm going to walk over there. That's really the main reason why I tied down my hair because it's gonna be crazy and I have my SPF on I have my body oil on I also brought them with me in this little bag that I always walk with and yeah let's go I'm trying to get 20k steps today so let's see what we can do we are at this restaurant called Dini's seafood that was recommended to us by one of our crew members she was actually heading to work she's from New Orleans and it's New Orleans. New Orleans. No, like I say it sometimes, but Nolans. like I don't want to be fake. It's the big easy. They, they say it's the big easy. No love. No love. No love. Yeah. No love to ya. <laughs> um, I don't know. I guess I'm gonna try. You know, I'm gonna try something new today. I'm gonna try oh, yeah. the catfish. Yeah, oh, for your Never uh, had that before. No, for my I'm hungry. I'm hungry. I'm today. I'm. I'm ready. I never thought of. Yeah. Menu, oh, by the way. Yeah. Well, I'm, I'm gonna have to figure it out, I want her and then I'll come right back. Yeah, so I got my French 75. This is my first time actually trying to French 75. I had to look up information yeah, on it, and allegedly it was made in 1915 at a bar called the New York Bar in Paris. It has gin, champagne, sugar, and I think I am too. It just sounds. I mean, it was so good that little teaser. So yeah. But then I'm like the barbecue shrimp sounds good the shrimp pasta sure. sounds good combo yeah. dinner oh. with fried oysters and fried catfish which I've never had before then I got the shrimp po' oh boys at this point the bartender server asked me are you having this to go but I'm gonna have everything now and what I can't finish I'll take home but I will finish it and then I also got the okra gumbo soup so I don't know what's in the gumbo, but I'm gonna I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it, I'm gonna enjoy it. And like I said, whatever I don't finish, I'll just bring home with me. And yeah, my bill's gonna look real pretty, but guess what? I we get paid tomorrow, so I don't care. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the apple martini. I've never had it before. Should I try it now? It looks really nice. Guys, it's like, it's I got the gumbo. This is it right here. And Christopher got the shrimp and crab and dip with garlic bread. So we're gonna tear it up right now. <laughs> so this is my first time trying gumbo, guys. You never had gumbo? I never had gumbo before. So I'm gonna try. It. Does it look like? Does it look like what you? I mean, it looks like gum. I don't know. I'll do another. Uh, no, I think this is the lager. This is the uh, Abita. The uh, amber? Uh, is there a lager? I think that's, that's a, that's a red lager. I'll do the I'll do the Kolsch. I'll try the Kolsch. Yeah. This is nice. This is good. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Well, yeah, I had it. I had it. I don't know, but this is delicious. Yes, but this is delicious. Don't be angry. <laughs> like it. 
I didn't know there was rice and gumbo, but now I do. Let me tell you something. Mm. This here, your dip scat pot. What does it taste like? This right here. You can leave it there. I got the LASIK like seven here. years ago, and it's like the best thing. Okay. It's about, I mean, so far it's the yeah, best thing I've ever, ever done. We'll see in ten years. Wow. Is that how long it's going to last? Wow. Look no, at I mean, it's supposed to last the rest of your life, but like you hear about people. Uh, we can go to Walgreens. Get. We can go to Walgreens for you. Shanae. <laughs> But they talk about something else. You know, what if you got beat up by Tommy? <laughs> mm. I don't care, I'm going to work. I'm going to work. Yes. Is that good? Huh? Mm. Uh -uh. Yeah. Is that good? Yeah. Oh, wow. We'll just go with that. Wow. This is so good. Mm -hmm. Hi, are you okay. here? Yes. Thank you. Wow. Wow. I have to see potato boy? fire. That's her too. That's her too. She's got a few. Look at you. You're not going to be hungry tonight. All right, I'm going to show you catfish. Sweet potato oh, fries. That's wow, good. guys. And you're just catfish. And then just catfish. Uh, this is the best. Really can't go wrong with shrimp. Then we'll head to my station. Which I got you. Yeah. Wow. First time trying catfish. So, what should I dip it in first? What's mm. this? This is a um, tartar sauce. And then that's, that's cocktail mm. sauce. Let's do the tartar sauce. I like things a little bit more creamy. Mm. It's nice. It's definitely very um. It's not tender. It was like I don't know how to describe it. Cocktail what did you get? Cocktail. You got the same thing? But you got the shrimp. I didn't get oyster. It was definitely more melt in your mouth type of a meat so light than a heart. I like it with a cocktail sauce. Shrimp sugar. And now let's try some fried oysters. Mm. Oh. The po boy. Mm. You want to try the um? Oh. With, with, with the crystal, it's good. I'm not a hot pepper fan. Mm. You're gonna try the um the oyster? Yeah, we'll have some shrimp. Thank you. Thank you. Do you like it? Mm, I do. Okay, the oysters are fine. Okay, tell me if you taste what the lady was saying. How about? Yeah, about it being healthy or something. Mm. Hard to tell. I fried. It is a hard to tell. I think it's good. I think it's very good. Mm. Well, fried. I love a good like baked oyster, or, like oysters Rockefeller. Drip people before the cutoff. Right. Before having the fun. And you know that ain't. Right. I ain't getting nothing of that. So thank you. Uh huh. So this month I happened to read and look. I was like, wait a minute. And so when I saw, all done with eating. I got my to go back of course and my bill came up to $71.64 so not bad at all definitely what we were expecting and I have a lot of food to go um, I have a whole half of the sandwich left and a bunch of catfish bunch of uh, oysters and fries and sides so I really want mommy to taste it and give me her true opinion on what she thinks the seafood is like. Mommy's been here before. Um, I'm not sure specifically in New Orleans, but she's definitely been to Louisiana before. So 
we're walking now back to the hotel. We're gonna enjoy ourselves. I won't be drinking. I won't be eating that much either. So I may just get something nice like a mocktail. And yeah, that's all I have to do. I got this six month belly. It's crazy. But make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in a minute. It's actually so interesting. I walked by this house literally 20 minutes ago, or 15 minutes ago, and there's a bunch of people here taking pictures. And it never dawned on me that this is a house that they filmed American Horror Story covering in. So that's why those girls were taking all those pictures. So, yeah, this is pretty cool. Louisiana style. From education is the leading cause. The public character, its color draws. From education as the leading cause the public character its color draws this is cool i'm gonna take a video and send it to sash good night b squad i'm done with new orleans we leave tomorrow at 4 a.m so i'm not gonna really be in the energy to say bye to the camera tomorrow i'm already not um i already don't have the energy right now i went on a walk i did 21,000 steps today. I'm so proud. I'm a tired. So <laughs> I am going to bed. I really hope you enjoyed the video. I love New Orleans. I have to come back. My crew was amazing. Like this was one of the best trips. Definitely added to top five. And I'll never forget this experience. And I'm so glad that I can show you. If you've never thought about visiting New Orleans, I highly recommend it. Beautiful culture just diverse everything about it i love i love it's very interesting and i will see you guys in the next one like comment share subscribe bye oh i'm all up in the camera skincare done and everything but yeah good night bye.